cover that number two. There's been a change of plans. I'm going to just make this one random and throw the jokes in it. Because I do have to work tomorrow. And today has been a complete clusterfuck. I didn't get to type in my book. Things just kept going wrong with technology today. Which really sucks. I also want some more chips. I know, I know, I need to stop eating. I need to really stop eating. Because I'm like 20 pounds overweight. So I have to start losing weight. But there's just no time. Because on Tuesday, I'll be sitting in the doctor's office. Not a happy camper. I did make a secretary laugh today. Which was cool. We talked about the camera going up my butt. That wasn't cool. But we did talk about that. And so the military hospital never called me back to let me know what the phone call was that I missed. Because apparently when I was trying to help get the lawnmower started, the military called me and I missed the phone call. So yeah, my phone was on the charger because um, cell phone companies have found a way to totally screw us. You guys remember, where's my cell phone? Y'all remember when y'all could do this? I hope this is the right phone. Yep, it's the right phone. And you can just pop your battery out, go to the store, get a new battery, good to go. And now, you can't. You can't even consider getting your battery out. So now you have to pay for the battery, plus the service, to get your battery fixed. They have found a way to totally and completely screw us over. And I'm not happy about that. But I am a slave to technology, but only my cell phone and social media, and because I'm an actor, I need my cell phone. That's an unfortunate event of something that is definitely needed for people to survive in this day and age. So I think that every cell phone company has decided to do that just to, to make us dig in more money. I mean, iPhone was probably doing it first, but now Samsung has caught on to the Ponzi scheme, and I'm mad as hell about this shit, because I love my Samsung, don't get me wrong, you know, but I don't love the fact that I have to not only now pay $65 for a new battery, but worse than that, I have to, if I can, I cut this damn thing off. I have to not only pay for a new cell phone battery. But I have to pay to make sure that the bitch gets installed. No, and this motherfucker will not cut off. Okay, that's how that works. I could have just popped the battery out. But anyway, I'm going to end this video. And I want you guys to tell me if you feel the same way. Do you ever feel like God and his trusted angels, not like the low-level angels, but you know the angels that actually do shit, like Gabriel and Michael and... Ezekiel or whatever the hell the guy's name is. Do you ever feel like God has his selected group of angels that are off in a corner and every time something goes wrong in your life, they're sitting in that corner and they're just laughing at you? Because I feel like that. Like all the time. Like today, I'm pretty sure there was a whole bunch of angels chuckling when this laptop decided to say, fuck you, Echo, and die while I thought I was doing something, filming and everything. Kind of find out it also might have been the fact that I had the tablet over there on the power button. And my dumb ass didn't realize it. But it wasn't that because what it was when I got back to the extension cord, the extension cord wasn't plugged into the other extension cord to feed the laptop power. That being said, I am Echo Fan Grey Wolf. This is Comfy Havoc number two. Enjoy your day. I'll see you guys tomorrow.